Well, what's up guys? Got Dave here and I just wanted to talk about one of the coolest things about riding a motorcycle as far as being out on the street here versus cars and I was reminded of it we're driving to work and back uh, this week like Monday through Thursday because it was just raining like crazy and I decided to drive instead of instead of uh, ride my bike and it's weird because like when you're in a car you're just like in the lane and you're just like sitting here you're like that's you know like pretty much your view you know and you're just like cruising along and that's all you're doing where on a bike you could do whatever you want you know like you got like all this room and all this freedom as far as like if there's a driveway up there and i see somebody's coming out and they're gonna like make a turn or something and i'm not sure if they see me i could get way over here on on this side of my lane and increase the visibility of someone like coming out of a side street like that or if there's something in the road i could just be like whoa and i can like swerve around it without ever leaving my lane you know and if you think about like as far as like avoiding something in the road you don't really need anything more than like a third of the lane or even like half of the lane in order for a car to like really have to swerve like crazy to avoid that versus being on a bike you don't you know you could still you could just move all around you could stay within your lane and avoid things or uh, like potholes you know like a lot of roads like if they got potholes and you're driving in your car uh, usually they're right where your tire is going and you're just like bam bam you have no choice where if you're on a bike you could just like go over here where they're not and where it's smooth and just cruise along and it, it gives you freedom to do different things that you can't do in a car the biggest thing to remember about lane position is that it could either increase or decrease your visibility and that's what you got to think about when you're on a bike you know like if you're riding down the street like this and you're like over on this side of the lane i think that decreases the visibility of like if there's a car like coming out of a side street or something it's harder for them to see you like say that guy's looking and that pulls in the way you know what I mean you know what I mean instead of like if I'm out here and that guy's looking it, it changes the whole angle and I think that he can actually see me sooner you know I think he could see my headlight sooner and see me better and therefore hopefully not pull out in front of me and in addition to that I could also see him better too like if I'm way out here, I could see way down the road, like especially around a right hand curve like this versus if I'm in here, I could barely see like all this crap's in my way where if I'm out here, I could see no problem. And I always try to think about that stuff when I'm riding. I always try to think about lane position and where I'm at, what I'm doing, you know, am I increasing my visibility or am I decreasing it? You know, like uh, I try to ride consciously as far as things like that go but uh driving to work and back it, it just made me think about it a little bit more and appreciate it and you know, it's these lights are freaking ridiculous dude there's nobody coming dude why is there a freaking green light i just figured i would talk about that remind you guys you know like think about where you're at on the road in the lane and a lot of times uh, a general rule is not good enough like like some people say people will be like well i ride just right of center you know that's where you should be in the lane is just right of center not always dude sometimes you want to be like way out here up on the line so you could see something or so you could uh, who knows dude there are a lot of different situations and there's there's not one solution to all those situations you know that's you got to customize your riding and you know it's like rules are good i guess like like just right of center or like that type of a thing you know that's i guess that's okay like when you're starting out and you know it just gives you some idea of what to do because at least that way you're not like in the middle where all the oil and stuff is you know at least if you're just right of center then when you come up to a light you're going to stop in a tire track you know but i think that it's more important that someone explain that whole technique and that reason why you're doing it and everything it's more important and more beneficial to explain that to a rider and you know like teach him that way rather than just give someone a, a blank rule as far as like well just do this all the time i i don't think that 
you should do anything all the time <laughs> except watch out <laughs> you should watch out all the time but other than that you know like you shouldn't ride to the left of the lane or ride to the right of the lane or do this or do it all the time because all the situations are different so let me know what you think like I always say leave me a comment give me your opinion and I will talk to you in the next video you guys have a great day ride safe out there peace